Hello everyone and welcome to a new adventure in The Investigation, which is a 3D point and click horror type game where we play as a fearless detective who is on the case with her partner to find a heartless murderer who has been torturing his victims and keeping them locked in, in torture rooms full of torture and, and more torture and death and torturous death. The worst kind of death and the worst kind of torture but we're here to stop him because that's our job and we're gonna do it very well because we're good at it and that's why we're a detective let's get into this okay can't wait to get not tortured and not die important notice following demo has been developed using only unity game creator tools cool seems pretty cool because i haven't really seen what this game looked like to be oh i haven't seen anything like it calling reinforcements instead of breaking in alone that's not how i roll the first time we have a real lead on the king's road killer chris i'm not letting him escape an anonymous tip is not a real lead even if he is here we could be falling into his trap then stay behind me princess <laughs> damn we don't take any sass from anybody my god this game looks awesome like i said i haven't seen something like this like a 3d kind of point and click whoa oh cool Click on the floor to move. Okay. Christian Sanders. We've been working together in the NYPD for over how long? Three years. All right. So we are Rebecca. We are a fearless detective here to stop a crazed murderer. I see something glowing over here. What is it? I, I, I see a glowy. Okay, okay. Maybe my eyes are just deceiving me, but. All right. Oh my God. I need to find the key. I think it's over there where it's glowing, but I don't know. This definitely reminds me of like old style games. Click to interact with the environment or the object. Aha, that's a big old fashioned key. Thank you. I uh, needed a big old fashioned key from a big old fashioned heist. This actually reminds me of another game I played. It looks very similar in terms of environment, but I love the film grain, film grain aspect of it and how it just looks really kind of like old style and retro kind of. All right, is our princess not gonna follow us? Who said it should be complicated? You didn't do shit. Get us in trouble, Christian. You were just standing there. I did the job of finding the glowing key. My God, no respect in this partnership, none at all. All right, now where are we? Oh God. Oh God. What is that noise? Who's making noise? Are we in the subway? All right. You just gonna stand over there while I do all the real work? I see how this goes. I've been in this rodeo before. Okay. My God, the camera angle is gonna get me. It's gonna get me so, at least once. I know it. Ugh. I don't like hey, these Chris, kind. Of, what is take this? a look at this. What are we, what are we looking at? Oh, you're actually gonna do some real work, this Chris. Is the distribution board. It seems that the emergency circuit is working, but the rest is busted. All except. Yep. Three fuses are missing find them and we can power up this place why would we want to do that why do we need to power up the place shouldn't we just be like going around like looking for a murderer okay should I go upstairs can I go what it probably wouldn't work right the elevator won't work because we need fuses or it will work because I'm a genius <laughs> obviously uh, where else wait where can I go what part shouldn't I wait for my partner that uh, the elevator won't move. Okay, got it. Oh, wait, whoa, this one will move, apparently. Okay, oh, a fuse. Got it. Wait, get the fuse. Get the fuse. Hell yeah. I know what a fuse looks like. Got it. It's probably really dirty and dusty. I didn't bring any hand sanitizer. Blech. Okay, so we need two more, right? And then we can find our criminal. Okay, I this camera angle is getting to me. I already knew it would. Okay. We need to find two fuses, and we need to find a new partner, because the current one's kind of an idiot and won't really do anything. You look at him, he's just standing there. Look at him. He's not doing anything. Mr. Chris, whatever his name is. What is this? All right, that was a loud squeak. Oh, I guess I can go in here now. Oh, lovely room filled with cabinets of drugs and death. Where are we going to find that torture room that I saw in the little cutscene preview thing? That looked like a fun time. Is there anything over here? Anything I need? I can't really. Oh, I see it. I see it. I like the little glow effect. It actually helps because of, like I'm I said, sure the camera angle and everything is kind of hard to see stuff, but I like that. I like it. It helps. It helps the brave detective, Rebecca, forgot her last name, find what she needs to find. 
because we're on the case and we will not be stopped until we bring this criminal to justice or you know die trying which is probably the more likely outcome because I'm in control here but unless we have backup you know I always say that horror games aren't that bad when you have a friend with you Chris you are my friend today I know I talked some shit on you but wait is he not gonna follow us down this dark and spooky hallway is he gonna do anything this door is magnetically locked I need the power on to do anything with that and it's also this is just the demo so there's also room for improvement and room for change in anything whoa oh the bathroom great okay hello is there gonna be like blood written on the walls like uh, make sure to wash Ooh, your hands yeah. who would drop a fuse in a sink someone who wants it to be clean I'd say that's the most sanitary spot for it to be it could have been in the toilet and then I would have been like ew crows but I mean in the sink at least you can just wash it off god okay all right what what oh it, it kind of just stopped I was assuming some like face was gonna be in the door don't do that to me Rebecca let's go let's get these fuses on and let's solve a crime or two I don't know it's working nice now what do we do Ugh. now what do we do that's the power's on should we take the elevator that's a loud generator. Look who's come to play. My two favorite detectives. Rebecca Kiss <laughs> He's talking about and me. Christian Sanders. How nice of you stopping by to say hello. Cut the crap, hey, man. Road. I swear I'm going to find you. And when I do, I'll... Rebecca. Oh, you'll what? Kill me? Put me behind bars? Oh, please, Becky. Don't speak words you can't Oh my god, to. Becky. But, 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 I can promise you something, dear friends. I've prepared a small, big surprise for you. Small, big. Spoiler alert. Wait, what? What? Oh, wait, it's a bomb? Wait, Cr Chris, we don't have time to casually take a stroll if there's a bomb. What are you doing, my man? All right, let's get in here and defuse stuff. I'm not trained in bomb defusal. Okay, I'll give it a try. Cut the red wire. Wait, what is this? Here's what what is this? Did, did the murders? Okay, why is there a TikToking? TikTok, stop. TikTok, stop. Okay, why is Kesha in the building? The table. Look at the table. This is really high pressure and I don't even know what's going on. Chris, what do we do? Okay, we've been working together for Okay, that's very nice and dandy, but what the fuck am I supposed to do? There's a sink. I'm gonna turn on the sink. No. So why would you do that? That's stupid. Go to the thing that's glowing. I just talked about it earlier. We gotta glow. What is this? Oh crap. Rebecca, we gotta get out of here. Oh no, this place that's is the ticking. I can't allow to let it blow up. I'm Again, I don't have any. The question is, I'm not qualified. Cut the red wire or the green wire? Are you fucking with it? All right, this is the question. Is the developer fucking with us? Because it's always the red wire, but what if it's the green wire? Red wire? Fuck. Ah, damn it. I knew it would have been. Leave it. Oh, wait, are we dead? Oh, oh, okay. Well. I guess I'm gonna go ahead and cut the green wire. Fuck me. Damn it, Rebecca. Shouldn't we be calling reinforcements instead of breaking in alone? This guy doesn't know how spoiler rewards are supposed to work. Because if you say spoiler, then you just immediately spoil it. What's the point of the spoiler? I, ca I can't like just, just close my ears going la 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 la. It's not how that works. This time, I'm not going to go for the stereotypical red wire cut. I'm going to go for the more sophisticated, oh, Rebecca, we've get delicate green no, wire cut. Because apparently I had bomb defusal experience. I'm going to disarm this bomb. The question is, All right, here we go. Or the, or the green wire. I'm gonna go with the green one. Well, okay. 
Glad, glad I went through all of that again just to uh, get the little cliffhanger there. I thought we were going to stop ourselves a murderer, but I guess not. I, like I said, this is just a demo, and I'm actually really looking forward to anything else this game has to offer in terms of development because this looks really cool. I love the 3D point and click style of it and like how it looks kind of old stylish type game with the camera angle and the film grain effect. It looks really cool and I, I really like the voice acting. It, this game looks and feels really professionally made. I love it. And I cannot wait to solve more crimes with our trusty Rebecca Castle and, and our kind of good for nothing partner Christian who kind of just kind of just stood there honestly he let me do all of the work he let me defuse the bomb find the fuses pretty pretty much pretty just a useless guy overall but either way I hope everyone enjoyed today's adventure in the investigation as always I hope you enjoy the rest of your day as well and hope seeing you next time bye bye